the streets so I can celebrate. Never knew I'm feeling better than today. Means to what beginning of a brighter day. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Tega Martins and today I am at Accord Lagos State College of Education. Guys, it's an amazing place. I met amazing friends and I decided to interview a friend of mine. His name is Femi. He works inside the school. Please stay tuned. Watch there's something one or two that you are going to learn for this bit from this video. I'm very sure you two are going to learn one or two things from this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, please. Get an end of feeling men than what we break. Find the solution and this you control. So we are at um, Accord and I'm here with my friend. Hi. This is where? This where is, is Adenin Road for your College of Education. Education, okay. Um, on the Adenin Road College of Education, we have school, we have five schools. Okay. Which is the School of Languages. Okay. The School of Science. Okay. The School of um, Secret, which is now a School of Education. Okay. The School of vocational and technical education and also the school of art and social sciences i was once a student in adenero busaya college of education okay and i graduated 2007 Okay. So I study economics computer as a student. Okay. So you are working here now? Yes. Okay. So um, basically, I want to know, I studied from Delta State University and I have one or two things to say that makes my school distinctive from other schools. Wow. So I, I, I'm sure that you also know one or two things that makes your <laughs> school distinctive from every other school. So what would that be? Well, based from my own experience and okay. based on the period I've spent. Where is this? This is what we call the library. Oh, this is the school library. Okay. Uh, was, uh, so yes, what makes Adair Niro Ogunsoya University? College Sorry, of Education. College of Education. Number Unique. one. There okay. is something I always believe. There's something we call mother of all jobs. Okay. Which is known as teacher. Okay. Now, mm. it is the mother of her job, her mother of her professions, irrespective of you being a doctor, a lawyer, um, a judge, uh, irrespective education, teacher, lecturers, they, uh, they would have put one or two things into your life. Yeah. So, this College of Education has provided many graduates okay. beyond this beyond beyond being a lecturer or a teacher, a doctor. Mm -hmm. So one of those things that make Adenero Gonsoya distinguished among other schools is schools, one. Yeah. It is a college of education okay. where they provide a teacher, okay. which is mother of all professions. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. I quite. I totally agree. I didn't. I didn't even think of it like that. But it's true. I have one question to ask. Okay. If you look at the era of education in Nigeria and all over the world, you see that in old times, people go to school to learn, and then they want to work with what they have learned in school. You see people aspiring to be doctors. They go to school and they become doctors. But nowadays, I've discovered that people would go to school and study um, probably English, study philosophy, study something. But at the end of the day, they end up becoming makeup artists, photographers, things that are not 
not so in line with what they have studied in school so do you think that it is still valid for people to go to universities i mean go to education centers like this or they should follow specifically their passions well based on your question now my own point of view might be different from other people okay firstly I have, um, let me say, a, uh, a mentor that does say something mm. that makes your hobby your profession. She said, anything you love doing at his, mm. without not giving you stress, yeah. just make it your profession. Okay. Now, you not having education to it makes it a light. Mm. There is a says that said, he who gives you education gives you light. Okay. That is my own Where is this place? This is um, Department of Technical Education okay. and also the school, secondary school, which okay. is Accord this International. Is Accord International School. Okay. So, those are those things that I believe in. Now, if you have a profession that you are doing, mm. like I assumed you are, you are kind of a person, your hobby is to cook mm. and like become a cook, once you become a cook, a chef, it is okay. But the taste of education makes it more super. It makes you distinguish between mm. you, a, uh, a canteen, a vendor, mm. and from someone that works in an organization, that cooks for an organization. Okay. Now, example, I, I met a Britain man some days ago. Mm. Some days ago, you asked him, sir, what do you do for a living? He said, I'm a chef. Mm. I was like, are you are a chef? He said, yes. This is your qualification. He said, I have master's in this. I have masters in this. I have masters in. This. I was like, wow! And you still become a chef? He mm. said, I will study home economics as a course. I was like, you study home economics? <laughs> I was like, ah, come on, you fall my hand, dude. Mm. But the fact I have education to back okay. myself up, okay. will give me a, a, a space, mm. a from, space from every other person, a, a space in where, where people are being needed. Mm. I can't work with the president now. And the president will be asking me, what is your qualification? And I, I, I don't know. So what you are trying to say is that if you can even miss, in your passion, yes, you have to go to school. That is the point. You should not just follow your passion alone. Of have course. education as a backup to it. My dear sister, okay. that okay. is my own point okay. of view towards it. This is so amazing because um, I think a lot of youth are going to learn a lot from this because most youth nowadays they don't some of some of them don't have passions for going to school and all this thing but mr femi has just told us that it is a good thing to have passion for a particular field in your life probably you want to be a, a fashion designer you want to be a photographer but then what gives you that light in that field of your passion is education so in every in everything you do make sure that you crown it up with education because that gives the yeah. light yes and also brings a timeline to people mm -hmm. thank you thank you very much thank you so much mr femi for having this time with me guys i hope you have learned one or two things from my channel if you love what we have talked about please subscribe leave a nice comment on the comment section i love you comment like and i'll see you on my next video thank you bye